This week on StarCamp, quadruple murder rocks crawl, one done gang leader speaks at sentence in hearing, Grant spent tense, Juliet Holness promoted, and in the Tell Me Pastor review, my husband has no use in bed. Hey StarFam, I'm Jaleen, and welcome to another week of StarCap a recap of the big stories that lit your attention this week. The tight-knit community of Crawl in Riversdale, St. Catherine was rocked by a shocking quadruple murder on Tuesday morning. Then are Dorothy Higgins and her daughter Carrie Ann Higgins McGrath and their domestic helper Diane Johnson and her partner identified only as Kevin. The incident took place around 2 a.m. when residents reported hearing gunshots. The police were summoned and upon their arrival, the bodies were discovered. The perpetrators spared the lives of five children who were present at the time of the murders, including a six-month-old infant. The much-anticipated sentences of the 15 individuals belonging to the Klansman Wandon gang who are convicted for various offenses began on Monday in the Home Circuit Court. Leader of the gang, Andre Blackman Brown, opted to represent himself before presiding judge Justice Brian Sykes. On the opportunities he was given to speak, he quoted Bible scriptures as well as asked for pardon for his co-convicts, stating that they were under his influence and just following orders. Lawyers for the gang members also asked for leniency for their clients. The sentencing was adjourned to allow Justice Sykes time to deliberate. Judgment is expected to be handed down on Monday. The St. Andrew community of Grand Spen remains in a tense mood after a number of murders committed over a short span left residents wondering if this indicates the start of a community war. The latest incident was a triple murder that took place on Sunday on Shortwood Lane off Grand Spain Road. Just a day before, David Clark, the brother of entertainer Jashi, was gunned down outside his father's shop. Residents have expressed shock at the recent upsurge in killings and are hoping that the authorities can intervene before it escalates. A curfew was imposed on the community. Juliet Holness was on Tuesday elevated to the post of Speaker of the House of Representatives, taking the chair previously occupied by Marissa Dalrymple Philibert, who resigned in the wake of allegations she falsified her statutory declarations. Holness, who is a Member of Parliament for St. Andrew East Rural, was nominated by Acting Leader of Government Business Delroy Chuck and the nomination seconded by his opposition counterpart Philip Paulwell. Hero Clark, Member of Parliament for St. James Central, was nominated as Deputy Speaker of the House. In Tell Me Pastor this week, my husband has no use in bed. My husband needs to step it up in bed is the cry of this 39-year-old woman who wrote to Pastor Dumas for advice on impotence. The woman states that her 59-year-old husband is unable to maintain a firm erection and she believes his drinking habit is what has contributed to his malfunctioning member. He insists he is not the issue as he's had sex with two other women and he did not face that issue. She is longing for sexual satisfaction and is wondering what she can do to ease her problems. Starfam, can you share some tips and tricks to help? Tell us in the comments. And that's it for this week's StarCup. Remember to follow us on Facebook and Instagram at The Jamaica Star and on X, formerly Twitter at Jamaica Star. I'm Jaleen. Until next week, keep reading The Star, The People Paper. Mm -hmm.